Flowers are an important part of any garden for both pollinators and beauty. Plus, many are edible. Of course, not all edible flowers taste great, but if you choose the right ones, you can increase your harvest and broaden the range of ingredients from your garden. There's lots of flavours and textures in our garden, and I'm going to show you some of my most favourite edible flowers. It's really important to harvest them first thing in the morning before they experience any heat stress. Or you can pick them just before you eat them so they're nice and fresh. The hard seeds pansies can be picked as a whole flower. You can pop them into your salads or into ice cubes, which can then go into your fancy drinks. To my palate, the flavour resembles a faint musk. Rocket flower is as delicious and as peppery as the leaf. The vibrant orange and yellow petals of the calendula flower are a real pick-me-up, perfect for decorating your desserts. The calendula flower actually has quite a tough base, so you don't eat the whole thing. Instead, you gently pluck off the petals, throw this back in the garden, and this is for your plate. Now, borage has prolific dainty blue flowers with a faint taste of, hmm, watermelon. It can be invasive in some areas, so eating the flowers has another benefit. It reduces the amount of self-seeding. Pea flowers are sweet and taste a bit like a young pea. Add them to any plate, along with their young shoots and tendrils. But make sure you don't confuse them with the toxic flower belonging to the sweet pea. For the more discerning palate, try the strong nasturtium flowers. You can also eat the leaves and flower buds. These little beauties also have a little sweet treat hiding for you. You can suck the sweet nectar out of its base. You can also do this with salvia plants. Their flowers are not so tasty, but the nectar is delicious. It's like nature's lolly. Using flowers is an easy and cheap way to get more beauty and fun out of your garden and into your kitchen. So enjoy the diversity of textures and flavours and make a vibrant flower power salad. <laughs>